Hey there, welcome to Srija Animations. Today it's all going to be about Indian astronomy through the ages. Indian history has always made me curious. Like who knew that shampoo was invented in India and also the extremely strategic game of chess. But um, that's not the topic now. Indian astronomers were way ahead in the concept of astronomy. Yeah, we also have to accept that most of their work was on astrology, like you know, seeing or a planet or star's movement and predicting our future. Though it's not considered scientific, astrology made Indian astronomers learn a lot. They found that there are other planets and stars they called Surya for sun, Chandra for moon, Shukra as Venus, Brihaspati for Jupiter, and Shani for Saturn. In astrology of that time and still, we believe that Saturn or Shani is evil and Jupiter is good. Like, what could those, you know, balls of matter do to us? Indian astronomers also cleared many misconceptions we had, like Indians believed that when demon called Rahu swallowed the sun, a solar eclipse occurred. And another demon called Ketu swallowed the moon, a lunar eclipse occurred. But thanks to the legendary Indian astronomer Aryabhatta who bought the concept of eclipses. Aryabhatta also came up with a pretty exact length of an year. Aryabhatta said that an year was 365.2586805 days which is nearly equal to the current value we have which is 365.2422 days. But we have to appreciate the fact that Aryabhatta calculated the value without any measuring apparatus up to 7 decimals. India's very old astronomical and astrological knowledge survives through Vedangas. Vedangas are like branches of the Vedas, the sacred texts of all kinds of knowledge. Our knowledge of stars, planets and outer space comes from one such Vedanga called Jyotishya Vedanga. Also Aryabhata's book Aryabhatiya and Surya Siddhanta and Varahamira's book Pancha Siddhanta, all being written in the 5th century, also gave a lot of information. To pack up, we can say that Indian astronomers and astrologers gave us a lot of information regarding this vast, endless universe. So that's all for now. Until the next update, you could check out this playlist. Thanks for watching.